YouTube, this is Justin Irving, and I'm going to show you how to make a shirt on Roblox. It's going to be a pretty simple video. So first, what you want to do is open a shirt template. And once that, I'm just going to make a plain white shirt. So what you want to do, you want to get out your paint bucket, put on like any color you want. For example, that, just... Until you get to here, you're going to select the rectangle select. I'd say like a brown like right here. And then what you want to do, get the paint bucket out. Hold sh control and shift and it will color in everything. Now if you got those little lines that you want to take out, um, just press the undo button. Press the move selection. Just click your arrow key down just once. And just fill those in. And once you have that, um, for a neck hole, I mean, you can use your magic wand, select one of these sides, uh, move selection, and kind of move it to the middle a little bit. And, um, <clears throat> you can take the eraser, um, make it pretty big. Say around like you know maybe not eighty, but like sixty five. Yeah, sixty five is good. Oops, let's turn this off. Make sure you turn off anti anti lassing, cause it just makes a shirt like pretty weird and like you know, you'll you'll see. So what you want to do is press hold on control and press C. And then once you've done that, you press Ctrl and V, and that's copy and paste. Move it down. Section it up a little bit. And then, let's continue the whole, I guess. Just kind of make it like a 70. There we go. Can you do that neck hole? Then you're going to zoom back out, and this is the shading part. Um, I'm going to get out my shading. And then, all you got to do is just select that. And copy, control, and C. And then add a new layer. Control and V. Deselect. Go to background. Magic wand. Control and shift. And then control and C. And then go back to layer 2 and control and V. And flatten the layers and or um, combine them together. And now you have your, um, you can, you have your Roblox shirt. It's pretty much easy as that. You can edit images by going to Google. You know, try to make real life shirts like I do. And, um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.